Ladies and gentlemen, please rise to welcome the President of Singapore, Madam Halima Yaakob. Ladies and gentlemen, please be seated. Good morning, Madam President, Minister Grace Fu, Parliamentary Secretary, Mr. Bei Yam King, Mayor, Dr. Dio Ho Pin, Deputy Secretary, Mr. Philip Ong, IRCC Chairpersons and Members, Distinguished Guests, Ladies and Gentlemen, Welcome to the National IRCC Convention 2018. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Huawei Southern Pacific ISP Summit 2018. My name is Wayne, and of course, it's my pleasure to be your host on this beautiful morning. Now, on behalf of Huawei, I would like to extend a very warm welcome to all of you. We appreciate you taking the time off your busy schedules to join us here today. Now, we hope that the exciting program that we have lined up for you will be fruitful and engaging. And now, to formally kick off our event this morning, it is my pleasure to invite the President of Huawei Southern Pacific Enterprise BG, Mr. Daniel Cho, to deliver his opening address. Mr. Daniel Cho, please. Good morning and welcome to the Investify Symposium 2018. Thank you. Great to see everybody so awake. Of course, my name is Wayne Chan, and it's my pleasure to be your host on this beautiful morning right over here at Suntec City. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the theme of our event today, or the aim rather, is to help you build multiple streams of income by learning how to invest in different asset classes. And that's where we get the name, Investify. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the Investify Symposium has invited renowned experts. Today, you'll be learning from people in different fields, such as entrepreneurship, online business, real estate investments, rates, and of course, stocks as well. And you know what? We're going to be having some very exciting prizes, okay? We're going to be giving away a sports watch and two tablets. So make sure you stay with us all throughout today. Now, talking about the experts, it's my pleasure right now to tell you about our first speaker for this morning. He has a very, very interesting story. In 1992, at the young age of 21, this gentleman started his own construction business in Japan. And by the time the company hit the fifth year mark, he had made 1 billion yen. And in nine years, he surpassed 2 billion yen. Sounds like the perfect success story, doesn't it? But ladies and gentlemen, of course, life is always full of twists and turns. And sure enough, in 2001, just moments before listing his company, the IT economic bubble in Japan broke and his company had to file for bankruptcy, leaving him in nearly a billion yen in debt. After filing for bankruptcy, he worked hard and invested more than 200 million yen over the course of eight years to learn from different successful people all around the world. Ladies and gentlemen, he's now a two-time best-selling author in Japan, a millionaire, and he owns an event management company. He loves to travel around Asia to share his knowledge and experience how anyone can start a business. Now, he'll be sharing with you how anyone can start a multi-million dollar business from ground zero. Don't we all want to do that? Ladies and gentlemen, could you please help me rise up on your feet 
and help me give a warm welcome on your feet, ladies and gentlemen, on your feet. When I say on your feet, it means on your feet. We want to give 100% energy today, okay? Ladies and gentlemen, please rise on your feet and help me give the warmest applause to the founder of Japanese event management company, Wavelink, Mr. Tetsuya Inumura. Come on! <laughs> Good morning. Hi, Gusanas. 